I'm stuck on you I got a feeling now deep in my soul That I just can't lose Guess I'm on my way I needed a friend Well, the way I feel now I guess I'll be with you till the end Guess I'm on This is the latest addition to the Yamaha range. It's called the Yamaha PS500 and it's absolutely fantastic. You can plug a microphone hint into it. It's basically a smart piano. It's P PS, I think it stands for Piano Smart and it's, it's just absolutely awesome. So what you heard then was the interactive harmonizer that it has built in when you plug a microphone in as well. So you can sing through it and have a harmony playing with your voice. But if you want to strip it right back, this is an absolutely fabulous GHS Yamaha weighted key keyboard, full 88 notes. It comes complete with uh, it's 660 sounds, 403 songs, hundreds and hundreds of rhythms and accompaniments, and a fabulous speaker system. But let's go right back to the Yamaha. CFX Concert Grand Piano. It's the top of the range of my piano that Yamaha produce. It's over £150,000 and it's in here. <laughs> set up all the sounds and everything manually and it's got a little light retro looking screen which looks great but the way it really comes into an absolutely completely amazing bit of kit is by connecting it to an iPad or an Android iPad or like I've done I've just connected it to my phone here and you access an absolutely massive array of things that it can do so let's have a look at some like I said there's over 600 sounds one of them's a Borsendorfer concert grand sound just by flicking this little switch here and then it shows you on screen which one you're picking and you can have an electric piano like this. <laughs> Absolutely brilliant. And um, it shows you and um, when you press the sounds uh, different categories, so for example, I could go to the guitar category and pick a classical guitar like this. <laughs> Obviously, if you've got your tablet, you can put it straight on the screen. Uh, you can get other sounds like steel string guitar. Some of the sounds are what they call super articulation voices. Well, what does that mean? It means they put more memory into that sound to allow it to do different things. Like, for example, slide the note like that. And look, things where it's like, it's like the guitarist is putting the hand back on the guitar. And it does this for all the different sounds. And it's like, you don't have to really think about it. It just does it for you and makes the sound sound a lot more real. You get loads of rhythms and accompaniments. So at the beginning there, I was showing you one of the rhythms. And um, what you can do is when you find sounds and settings that you like, you can lock them into memories here. So for example, I've put a, a setting in with a, a light rhythm accompaniment on it. You can split the keyboard. So I've split the keyboard and I've got a left hand sound down right down here with a choir like that. And I've got the piano up here. And then I can have a rhythm going like this. Four variations on every rhythm. 
each one and a little ending and a, and a little introduction, which is just absolutely fantastic. If I go to something completely different, I found one on here that just sounds like, you know, like House of the Rising Sun, that's <laughs> in here, and I've put an organ sound with it, and it sounds like this. <laughs> like a keyboard style where I've, I've split the keyboard so I can have my left hand down here, my right hand up there and have different sound settings on. So I'll just show you a couple more of those. So this one features a, a jazz guitar and I've found a little funk rhythm and like I said when you, because it's got hundreds and loads of sounds on it, when you find the ones that you like you just lock them into a memory and then there they are. So if I go on to here just go to my style and I can have a piano on my left hand. This <laughs> Press the fill it. from so I could pick something different this time I've got a, a dance beat going and it's uh, it's featuring like a, a bit of a synthy sound because there's there's every well there's every sort of sound you could possibly imagine actually in here but let's have a listen to this one <laughs> go back to my piano one of the settings that I've put in there is to basically just turn everything off and just put the Borsendorfer concert grand piano on for me now you the amount of bass and everything you get out of these speakers is awesome <laughs> can actually teach you how to play it as well if you're a beginner or it can give you loads of backing tracks if you're already an accomplished pianist. You can record audio, you can record MIDI into it. So for example me singing and everything, I could have recorded that if I wanted to. But there's lots of songs already built into it such as this one for example. And you'll notice it's showing cascading little lights and that showed me what chords to play for this particular song and you can have audio coming in and that can be any song that's inside your uh, device so any music you've got in there it will scan and it will show you what chords to play now you can either have it showing you the notation up on screen or just showing you the chords so I could jam along with this like this
you get the idea with that. But other songs you can have coming up, it can show you the notation to play and it will cascade the notes down to show you exactly what to do and how to play it. And there's from beginning lessons to scales to songs and you can download new ones. It's just an absolutely fabulous bit of kit. But at the end of the day, if you wanted to go right back to the beginning and just play it as a piano, it's fantastic for all styles like classical. <laughs> system now you can get the piano on its own as in just the top it has a flat base so you can put it on like an x-frame stand like one of those you can plug headphones in and you can play it to yourself if you wanted to as well or you can buy extra uh, a wooden stand like this that's like a wooden stand to put it on with a three pedal unit it already comes in the box with the piano a sustain pedal and the power supply and this music rest that also doubles up as somewhere to put your tablet or your device on when you want to use it. But I think this piano is absolutely fantastic and it's a really, really smart bit of kit. And I love the fact that it can teach you to play if you're a beginner or not. I like the fact that uh, you, if you're already an accomplished player, you can have loads of accompaniments and things. You can have lots of variety with the rhythms and accompaniments. And if you just put a song on playing, it looks fabulous. And there's, I think it's 403 of these as well. So it's absolutely brilliant. This is the Yamaha PS500. I've only just unboxed it. I just thought I'd give you a rundown on it as fast as I possibly can. And I think it's worth every penny. I think it's an absolute bargain digital smart piano. And it's available on our Rimmage Music website right now in black or white. And we've got them in the stores as well. So if you want one, get one from us. So hopefully you've liked my video, if you have, please can you press like and share and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel because we're putting new videos on there all the time. And uh, yeah, go and get one of these PS500s if you want to have lots of fun and learn how to play properly with the fully weighted key action. I don't think you can go wrong with this for the price, I think it's brilliant. So thanks for watching and we'll see you soon. All the best. Bye.